order of operations let's say we're gonna calculate 3 plus 4 times 2 or 3 times 2 plus 4 or 20 divided by 2 times 3 or between parentheses 5 plus 7 times 2 we're gonna go through other examples let's start with these ones so here uh, if we're just a beginner we're gonna be confused with which operation we have to start is it addition or multiplication so in mathematics there is a general rule which can be abbreviated with this acronym PEMDAS the P stands for parenthesis uh, British call it brackets and they use B instead of P but anyway the P is parenthesis E is exponential exponent if we have uh, we can take an example with the exponent. The M stands for multiplication, the D for division, A for addition, and S for subtraction. Actually, the M and D stands at the same rank, and A at, and S, which means addition and subtraction, stands at the lower rank. So the P is stronger than E. And so on. So here we have addition and multiplication. The multiplication is stronger, so it's going to be calculated first. So it's three. It's not going to be uh, uh, calculated at the first place. So plus four times two, which is eight, and then three plus eight, which is eleven. A second example we have uh, 3 times 2 so now it's clear that the uh, multiplication is stronger so it's 6 plus 4 which is 10 here we have only division and multiplication and we said that they stand at the same rank so which is stronger than the other no one is so we're gonna start from left to right so 20 divided by 2 is 10 times 3, which is 30. Uh, if we start by uh, uh, performing the multiplication, so it's 6. 20 divided by 6 is not 30. So the rule here is always to start from left to right. When we have only addition and I mean, uh, sorry, uh, multiplication and division. Here we have parentheses, and we said that uh, parentheses are the strongest, so we gotta calculate inside them first. Five plus seven is twelve, and twelve times two is twenty-four. In the following example here, we have addition and uh, exponents. Actually, the exponents is like a multiplication, so it is. This is stronger than addition, so we're gonna calculate this first. You're gonna be used to it um, by doing many exercises. So it's five plus. 3 squared which is 9 and it's 14 
next example we have addition and subtraction parentheses and order or exponent so the parentheses are the strongest so we're gonna calculate this first so it's 3 plus 7 minus 2 which is 5 squared now the order is stronger than the addition so 3 plus 5 squared which is 25 so it's 28 the last example we have small parentheses inside square brackets here there is no difference uh, in this symbol like I can use the brackets here the square brackets here and the parentheses out but when I have parentheses inside others we start with those at the inside so I'm gonna start with these so I'm gonna calculate 5 minus 3 first to get rid of these small parentheses so it's I can uh, start here so it's 10 plus 13 times so here 5 minus 3 is 2 now I can get rid of, uh, of the parentheses I can also write them but uh, since it's only 2 they would be uh, in no use so it's 5 minus 3 is 2 squared and then the square bracket so it's 10 plus 13 times 2 squared which is 4 now I have um, between brackets this product so it's 10 plus 13 times 4 I have 40 plus 12 which is 52 and uh, 10 plus 52 which is 62 let's take some uh, few more example what if we have only addition and subtraction we said that this 10 are the same rank so here we can start from left to right but in this case there is no problem we can start whether by adding or subtracting but if you change the order of these terms each term um, should save its own sign for example I can regroup these by starting by adding I can write 7 plus uh, or 5 plus 7 plus 10 and then uh, go to subtraction minus 2 minus 8 minus 20 we've seen previously the rules of adding integers with the same signs or with different signs so 5 plus 7 is 12 plus 10 is 22 and here it's like you have an addition of integers with the same sign which is negative we keep it in an add 2 and 8 and uh, if you have a problem with this you can see the previous videos about uh, subtracting and adding integers so here 10 is 30 22 minus 30 is negative 8 here we have addition division and multiplication 
the addition being the week is going to be the last one. Here I have division and multiplication. I'm uh, going from left to right. Here is 5. 10 by 2 is 5 times 5. Now I have uh, addition and multiplication. Multiplication uh, is the strongest. So it's 25 and it's 28. Here I have division, exponent, and multiplication. So the exponent. Exponent is the strongest. So it's 100 divided by 2 squared, which is 4, times 3. Now I have only division and multiplication. We go from left to right. 100 by 4 is 25 times 3. 25 times 3 is 75.